On over to set up 22 real quick so we can see how this game is going. Uh, Mr. E looked pretty comfortable in the last game. Had a pretty sizable lead for most of the game. Probably by a stock and some change. They're definitely doable. I think the stage pick also can definitely help Amaryllis a pretty good amount here, but gotta watch out. Yeah, Amaryllis has been in Mr. E before, but it is so much in Mr. E's favor. Like last season, it was all Mr. E. Season four, I think that was one of the few times I'm really started beating him, beating him. But it's starting to feel like it's the first season rather yeah. than the, the previous season. Still, Bayonetta certainly has a lot of meta development at their disposal for potential uh, touch of death conversions if they're able to find something. But he is just so good at turtling that it's really tough to play extended games with him. And because, as you mentioned earlier when we talked about Sephiroth, like, platform fighters inna like, innately are games about space. And while Bayonetta controls that with, like, particular uh, burst range hitboxes, like that dive kick, Lucina just does that by existing. Oh, yeah. And it's crazy how you say Eric is turtling, because when you this game started with Zeno, he was not a turtle. Yeah. <laughs> he was not. I won. It, he, the, he was forged yeah. in the fires of... Of, of Sinji numbers. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. 21 Ludlow Street. <laughs> he knows now to play a little bit differently. But speaking of a little bit differently, let's go oh my God, dip down. Lot.